continues right now at six heading to the northwest part of the state where they're really expected to take the worst of it. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Sharon Johnson is live. She is in Weather Tracker 1 tonight. Sharon, how's it looking out there? Hi, Marco. Right now we are on Route 202 driving through Avon. I'm going to turn the camera around so everyone can see what we have. So you see the temperatures are steadily dropping in this part of the state. It's still raining. It's sleeting a little bit. A mix of freezing rain and sleet. And earlier, the icy rain was really bouncing off the windshield. Now, crews have been waiting around all morning to treat the roads as quickly as possible. The trees are getting very heavy with ice right now. Uh, the power is blinking occasionally here in town. Norfolk Public Information Officer John Barbagallo says this has been an easy winter for the town so far, but today is a challenge. They haven't been able to put too much salt down because the rain is just washing it away. Uh, but uh, they are standing by. In the late afternoon, conditions worsened in Norfolk with slushy roads and a minor car crash due to the weather. What's difficult, Barbagallo says, different parts of the town could have different temperatures, so some people could experience ice, while others could experience just rain. You definitely need to take your time depending on where you're going. Across the northwest part of the state, public works crews have been warning people to stay off the roads if they can because of the freezing rain and wintry mix. With crews treating roads in the afternoon, roads will be dangerous. Just pay attention to the road and just uh, take it slow. Back out here in Avon, if you are heading out, once again, take it easy. It's hard to tell where that ice is, where that black ice could be. So roads are still slick out here. Be very careful. Live in Weather Tracker 1, Sharon Johnson, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.